Human greed has had no limits for the last many years. I'm not sure what day or month it is, but I suspect it is September. It all started when the world's climate as we know it began to change violently at the hands of man. And with the water shortage, crops started to deteriorate. Animals were the first living things to suffer. Later, all humanity. The world as we know it has been lost forever. When food became scarce, everything collapsed. Chaos took over. A fierce struggle for survival began. The authorities evacuated the young to makeshift camps outside the cities. Entire families were separated, and parents were devastated at having to abandon their children. They were never to be heard from again. Meanwhile, in the cities, people fought for the slightest hint of food. Order was lost, to be replaced by survival of the fittest. And finally, out of despair, it happened. In a civilized society, if individuals have their needs met, then society works correctly. What happens when all that order is lost and it turns into chaos? When nothing becomes important except for your own life and the lives of those you love, and you are forced to do things you would never have imagined being able to do before, in a society where those who should oversee order and justice no longer do so, and instead watch out for themselves. Where the cold and despair are your enemies, but hunger is the worst of all. And when the instinct to survive is so big that no law governs us and people do whatever they want, we cease to be a civilized society. We become animals, and so it is time to flee.
Radio e Wend Nerd. Yes, the Red, 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 the
Ah ouais, on... on peut... Ouais, ouais, euh, alors... I see a light at the end of the tunnel. I finally made it out of that filthy city. Although there is still a long way before we can be together once more. You would never imagine how much everything has changed and what we have become. The world as we knew it no longer exists. Our lives, our friends, everything is gone. Since you left, I keep wondering how you are, if you are alone. Where have these people taken you? Away from me, and for what? What do they intend to do with you? Wherever you are, whoever you are with, you have to be strong to resist. Because no matter where you are, or what they have done to you, I know that in the end we will be together again, Mary. Your father is on his way. <laughs> 